Okay, now hopefully all of this won't be totally upside down or backwards for you, but I wanted to go over the hostess packet and what all I put in. So um, you can see I have the hostess folder. I always write the party date, which is basically the dates that it runs from. Um, I never put a time in there because, well, we're not doing it at a very certain time. They need to collect their orders by the Friday of that week or the last day of the party. Um, the party show link, I always put a label here with my contact info. I use gold because I had a bunch of gold labels and that's what I've been using. And then I always um, check this box and write the their tax amount on there so that they will know what tax rate to use for outside orders if they actually use the order forms. So you can see I open it up. On the left side is where I put all of the hostess information. So I, I put their host special, which hers is for March, and also the guest special. And I put those in. I add five sales receipts. All right, I do the life taste great. And inside, I usually fold and put in um, whatever the hostess incentive is, or new consultant incentive, I'm sorry, for that month. And then um, the 30 day challenge, which I will be sending you a copy of. Okay. And so I'll place that right there. Um, three or so of the mini catalogs, if you have them, you probably receive some in your kit. Um, and I have since reordered. And then this is something else I will send you. This is the letter that I put in with the host on the host side. It just kind of tells them about their party, what to expect, um, gives the show link, dates, and just all the information kind of gets them pumped up and ready for their party. And then on the other side is where I put the catalogs. I'll put two catalogs in. Um, this one I already folded. But what I did for these is I always put the guest special on top so they know if they order $75 or more, they get to choose their free gift. And then for these, this particular hostess, her party is at the end of March. So I'm going ahead and putting the April host special in so that any guests that look over the catalogs will know what the April host special is if they might be interested in booking. Never, ever, ever feel bad about asking for bookings. And actually, you can pretty much get your hostesses to do it. And I'll, in another video, I'll tell you about that. Um, for this particular hostess. She won the early bird drawing and what I give for the early bird drawing is a season's best catalog. Um, this particular one I went ahead and wrote her a note in there because her party was far enough away I didn't for want her to forget that she was getting a gift and she'll know this was her gift. But I always put one of my labels inside so they always remember me and where it came from. And so that is the hostess packet. Now, um, one of the other resources that I'll be giving you in another video is where to get cute little bags like this. Oh, and I staple my business card on there. Business cards, I got mine from Pampered Chef. Um, tell you where that is. Some people get them through Vistaprint. I mean, you know, it doesn't really matter where you get them, just as long as you have your information on there. These bags are just super cute, and um, I just think it adds a special touch to the hostess packet. Um, and now, so to mail this out, I use Priority Mail, not Priority Express, but just Priority Mail. I found it to be the least expensive way to ship the packets um, because whatever you can cram in this envelope, it doesn't matter how much it weighs, it's always going to cost the same. And it is a snug fit, but that's okay. $6.70 and this packet will be on its way. It's well worth it. Um, 
and so I just seal that up. When I'm, uh, and then I use the labels. I just keep a stock of these on hand, and boom, there you go. Hostess packet ready to go out. Pretty simple. Um, I'll kind of show you a little bit of my mess. This is kind of a messy room. My office. We moved in this house. Um, oh no, you don't want to see me. Um, let's see. Let's turn this. Oh, I didn't want to take a picture. I want to. Oh, well, I want to turn the camera around, but can't figure out how to do it now. Anyway, I just kind of, I just have these on the wall. You'll find your own system of how to do things. And then I have my little dresser here that I have supplies in as well. So, um, anyway, there's your hostess packet. It's ready to go out. Easy as that. Oh, I wanted to tell you how I got this party. This particular party is... She won the season's best catalog, so whenever she sent me her mailing information, I went ahead and told her, hey, you know, um, since I'm going to be mailing something to you, it's just as easy for me to send you a hostess packet um, as well, and then you could have your own show and get your own hostess rewards. And honestly, it works almost every time, so never, never never miss an opportunity to ask for a booking. And so there's your hostess packet.